hello hello and look who's back it's me melody i'm back yes i am i know i've been gone since october don't get mad at me guys but um so in today's video i used all of boxy Lux's, um items that we received in march i know we're in april don't get mad at me but march was a pretty again interesting month okay so i had no time to do anything yeah if you guys want to see how i achieved this look using the boxy Lux march items then please keep on watching so let's get started with this look and again you guys already know what all the items i'm going to be using from the march boxy Lux box that we got and the first item that i will be using is the wander beauty lift off purifying and brightening peel off mask which is this one right here and then i'm going to start off so of course i'm going to make do a look with everything but i'm going to start off with the it cosmetics confidence in a cream the moisturizer oh that feels good i love this cream start off with my brows which is usually what i do and i'm going to be using the iconic london cushion sculpt and cushion eyebrow cushion oh sorry sculpt and bo boost lee and brush that it came in so it's this one you know and here are the colors so it's the medium brown and then the dark brown and i believe the medium brown will be right here and the dark brown will be right here for the tail Ooh, ooh here it is i don't know if you can tell oh you can't tell but okay here we go okay first impression this is pigmented like really pigmented oh i like it Hmm. all right so off camera really quickly i'm going to finish off my other one and of course um clean them up a little bit so i'll be right back okay so i really like how this brow cushion thing is because my brows are not bad you know and so the next item i'm going to go in because this is what i usually do after i do my brows is i go in with my eyeshadow so of course i'm going to be using the um morphe 15n night master which is right here and i don't know what kind of look i'm gonna go for but we're gonna do a look so this is how it looks very beautiful and of course i'm gonna first prime my eyes and for that i'm going to be using this is a new item for me as well i've heard nothing but good things about this item and it's the urban decay oh urban decay um eyeshadow primer potion in the shade eden and it looks like this cute cute and so i'm gonna prime the lids i'm not gonna set the powder or the <laughs> primer so i'm going to be going in first with the shade selfie which is this one right here selfie and I'm going to be using this Crown Brush Soft Crease Blender. And I'm gonna blend out the ed edges with the Pro Fusion Brush. I think I'm going to use Custom, which is this one right here. So I'm gonna do like a little halo look and that's why I left this part empty and I'm going to go in with the color Unique, which is this shade right here. It's really pretty, it's like a, it's like a gold looking color. And I'm just gonna use my finger just to dab that right in the middle. And then I'm gonna go back in with the shade Selfie, same brush and just diffuse these two really quickly off camera i'm going to do the same to this eye so i'll be right back okay so now i did the other eye as well but i do feel like i need a little bit more like depth especially on 
the outer and inner corner so I'm going to be going in with the color shook which is this one right here and I'm going to be using the same um, crown brush soft crease blender the one that I used uh, for selfie And quickly off camera I am too going to be adding my foundation concealer and then we'll continue on with the contour so I'll be right back okay so now that I have my foundation and concealer which by the way I used the Maybelline um, Superstay I did use a pour because I do have big pores so I used the touch and soul no pour no problem primer and then for concealer, of course, I use the Tarte Shape Tape in the shade Light Medium Honey. And now to use the Cover FX Perfector Face Palette, which I'm really, really excited about. And of course, I'm going to be going in with the contour color, which is right here. It's light medium, so light to medium. And I'm going to be grabbing my e.l.f contouring blush this is an oldie but goodie Ooh, oof. for finishing powder I'm going to be using this one which is finishing powder and I'm gonna go I'm gonna go in with the Moda brush which is the powder powder Oh, and the sponge that I'm using for my foundation and everything is the Juno and Co um, velvet fiber uh, sponge life changer okay and so I'm gonna of course use the blush which is oh, it's like a bright pink usually not a big fan of bright pinks but it is what it is and I'm going to be using the Morphe E4 It looks a lot pink but honestly in person it's not like exaggerated pink you know and so then for highlighter I'm going to be using the one on top which are actually I don't know so these two are highlighters but I don't know which one to use if should I use the more pinkish one or the more champagne-ish one I'm gonna go with this one which is on top of the contour color and it's more like a champagne brownish color and I'm going to be using the soft glow right soft glow brush mm -hmm. so I'm gonna be well it's huge I usually use the Morphe the Morphe M501 for my highlight but of course I'm gonna try out this one since we got in our boxy looks it's, it's okay so it's like really really soft glow and this one does actually make it look soft this is like perfect it's not oh, it's not a lot and it's not but it still gives you that like nice cute glow it's like to like I forgot to contour the nose so the one that I use for contouring the nose is usually the Morphe M572 which you see it has a little too dark but I'm just going to diffuse it a little with the mm -hmm. and then what I use to highlight my nose is the Sephora um, Pro Precision Concealer 45 and they told me that this is a concealer brush but I've always used it like just to kind of get more detail like highlight here here in the nose Cupid's bow, so I'm gonna use that, and of course, I'm good. I'm gonna go in with that highlighter. I'm ready for this highlight. It's not too bright, it's not too like um, soft. It's well, it is a little bit soft, but it's perfect. And so, then I'm gonna go back into the eyes and actually i'll finish that off camera so i'll be right back 
you guys honestly would not believe me if I said that this lash went on like that and this one was a mission okay oh my gosh does that ever happen to anybody or is it just me <laughs> okay so um i decided that i am going i am going to add a little bit of a sparkle on my eye um if i can find the thing oh here it is so i'm going to be using the urban decay heavy metal oh apologize for the lighting guys and it's in the shade Starfire. And I think I'm just gonna add little sparkles here a little bit in the middle. Oh, a dramatic, oh. That honestly made a whole difference. There we go. And so now, next up, I am going to be doing the lips. And for that, I'm going to be using the Becca. Excuse me while I remember. The Ultimate Lipstick Love. <laughs> and it's in the shade Taupe, which is right here. That's the shade. And I'm just going to be adding this. Oh man, I closed it already. My bad. I'm just going to be adding this right here. Okay, and off camera really quick, I'm gonna go do my hair, put some bottom, uh, put some eyeliner and mascara on the bottom lashes, and we'll be finished. Okay, and that's the finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed this little toot. I really like how simple yet glam, and I am loving the lips at first. When I first wash, I'm like, mm, it's a little bit dark, but it's not. It's like a pretty, I don't know, like a brownish, pinkish. It's beautiful, but I hope you guys enjoy it. Thank you guys so much for watching. And you can always find me on Instagram. Um, my username is at MelodyAvi93. Oh, no, sorry. MelodyAvi. Um, my Snapchat is MelodyAvi93. If you guys want to see more different looks, I have a lot more pictures there. So on my um, Instagram. So yeah, thank you guys once again. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, you know, the whole spiel. Thank you guys. Have a great rest of your day.